All right, now look on this cutting board and you shall see four little cardamoms. Yes, we're gonna use this exotic spice again, whole cardamom. We're not gonna crush them with the big knife. I will just break one open and show you that inside that one's empty, ha ha ha. Inside of here is a darker seed in the center. You can buy it ground up, but we're using them whole now. We're gonna take four of them and we're just gonna drop them in the food processor. And what are we gonna do with them, John? Chop them up. Chop them up. Ah, oh, look at that. It's not plugged in. Where's the wire? Hey, how about some plugging in music, freeze? Doesn't it? All right. You think they do that on a big fancy TV show? Yes, sirree, Bob. Now, we're gonna take some broccoli. We're gonna take a bunch of broccoli, which is two stalks. And what we're gonna do is hold on to them very carefully from the floret side and cut the stalks loose. We'll do that again so you can see that. Just hold them little florets down and cut the stalks off. Take the stalks and cut them into a few good sized pieces so you can throw them in the food processor. And we're gonna chop these up real fine. And while we're at it, we'll toss a long slim red cayenne pepper in there for good measure. Yes, you thought I was gonna cook something without hot pepper, no way! All right, now let's, ah! This food processor's got it in for me. Woo! Ah, oh, that's right, you can't hear a thing I say when I'm chopping like that. Now, it's very important that you want the stalks completely chopped up. Now, we're gonna take four tablespoons of butter and put that in our pan, and we're gonna add, woo boy, the fumes, the aromas, the powerful fragrance of hot pepper. Now, right in the pan it goes four tablespoons of butter, and you see these chunks that didn't get chopped up? Guess what? Back they go in there, and we're gonna chop them up! Now, unlike Indian food, we're not gonna cook this down in a thick sauce that is gonna be very tender, well-cooked. We're looking for a nice, crispy, crunchy texture. We got our beautiful chopped up broccoli stalks in there. We're gonna take one half cup of unsweetened coconut. Wonderful coconut. It's absolutely outrageous. We're gonna give this a stir. Stir this around here. And you know what? We're gonna take one half cup of cashews. You don't wanna buy expensive, fancy, whole jumbo cashews. You want cashew pieces. Now, if you happen to buy the good big cashews, you know what you do? Chop them up a little bit. Don't over chop them. You don't want cashew dust. Now, I may be nuts, but I like my nuts whole. Now, we chop them up a little bit. We're gonna get this sauteing and simmering and cooking around. Yes siree, Bob. Now, what we'll do here is we'll just clean up this mess. Yeah, we'll get rid of some of that stuff. We'll take and we'll get the food processor out of the way. No, I'm not gonna throw that, no siree. Now, we're gonna take ourselves, oh, let's start with a bunch of scallions. That is a half a dozen scallions. Three, six, maybe I got seven, you may not know. Now, we're gonna cut off their little rooty heads there. We'll cut those root sections off. What we're gonna do is we're gonna use the whole scallion, we're not gonna separate them. No siree, Bob, we're not gonna separate them. We're just gonna take a big knife, line those little babies up, and we're gonna cut them up. Nice, good-sized chunks. You want tasty, delicious, crispy, crunchy vegetables. Now, what I'm gonna do is just take, we'll throw the very dry tops away, and 
We're just gonna put them on the plate with our wonderful broccoli florets. We're gonna use those next. The Silani is like their vegetables crunchy. So we'll take one more look over here in the saute pan. We'll see that we're not yet starting to get some golden color. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna sit back, you're gonna relax, and you're gonna come back. And when you come back, we're gonna continue to cook with fire. All right, oh, peppers. <laughs>